Meet Skeleton Bob. Skeleton Bob used to be a wonderful painter, but then life took a wrong turn, and then he died, and now he's a skeleton. But he's come back to life to paint some real life pictures, but using the, uh, the, you know, uh, blood of his enemies. Anyway, today, we're, uh, using a, we're using a mod by that Tariosh guy, and, uh, I'm sure you know about him, but anyway, today, we're gonna be checking out what he's got. Let's do it. Alright, so there's a bunch of different mod uh, units in this mod. Uh, we've got the Dancer, we've got a Skeleton Potion Seller, a Skeleton Vampire. Do they do anything different? Oh, this guy doesn't even transform into a bat, he just is a bat with this vampire <laughs> body. Oh, but they both have somehow feared each other. What the heck? Hold on, does he actually... Let's put him back here. Oh, he doesn't, he doesn't transform. He just is a skeleton. He just began modding, okay? He's adding new things. He added all this stuff over here, which we'll take a look at here in a second. There's some kind of cool stuff in there. We got a uh, skeleton head butter and a skeleton taekwondo. Just a bunch of skeleton units. Oh, but look, they fear each other because they have the skeleton, the ske like the skeleton base fear. Hey, that's kind of <laughs> that's kind of derpy. They, they, they were just kind of falling over each other oh I got like a headbutt thing oh is that an elbow does it does the taekwondo unit elbow people oh my gosh that kick sound is just crazy dancer red dancer blue ready to go oh they almost fell over what do they do oh they just spin around did they slap each other whoa first one oh he, he, he died we got to do that again all right listen if you get your opponent in the hole you win or into the water they're just slapping each other. Do they actually take damage? I think they must be, huh? They have to have an attack or an ability. Everything has some kind of ability. And even the spinning, I think, does damage. Let's see. Oh, yep, they took, they're took. they taking damage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, blue. Getting mighty close to that hole there. Look out for the hole. Don't want, you don't want to fall down the hole. <laughs> uh, no, oh, oh, he's done. Goodbye, Mr. Red. Okay, then it looks like we had a bunch of teachers here. And one's called Iron Fist. Okay, let's see what he does against the dancer. What do you do against the dancer, Mr. Iron Fist? He misses. What does he do? Oh, he's getting picked up and thrown. Um. Ooh, whatever the Iron Fist is doing, he's doing damage. But it's at a very slow and painstaking, painful to watch pace. Oh, there he goes. He got him. He slapped him to death. You got a dual wield teacher versus a dual wield katana. Te well, no, he's got a teacher sword and a katana. So he's got a katana. Is the katana better? Oh, this is good job. Ooh, there we go. Somebody, somebody started fighting. Teacher versus teacher is probably not a good idea. He needs to be a teacher versus something else. Because this is kind of boring. Katana teacher versus four squires. What's he going to do? Ooh. Look at him. Oh. Don't mess with the teacher, man. I think you need more than four. Well, is that guy still alive? His arm's still moving. Oh, there it is. He's pretty He's pretty beastly. But what? Is the dual wield the same? I mean, it's, it's got to be the same. It's just a different weapon. Because he's still going to dodge and do everything the same way. Okay, yeah. So teacher's pretty OP. Uh, we also have a, sp a spinning one and an, ex an extra spinning one. Look at his nice little head. He got a beautiful head there, man. Does he? So the co real question is, does he uh, cause a tornado? So he causes a tornado. That's that's the true test. Yo, he is very interesting. He still is hitting. Whoa, the double slap backhand arena. Okay, let's find out if he actually will tornado. I don't know if he will. Everything. Oh, look at him. Yeah, he's tornadoing. There he goes. He tornadoed. But what does the extra spinning guy do? Oh, he's spinning even faster. Does that make? Does that mean he makes a bigger tornado? Or is it? 
Look at him. Good job, dude. He's a break dancer. When you find a break dancer unit in game, this is what happens. Look at him. He's like quite the dancer, break dancer. He's actually very elegant and very swift on his feet. A beautiful man at that too. All right, here we go. Let's see what happens. Is he tornadoing? Yeah, he's tornadoing. It's like the same. Pretty much the same tornado. Nothing different, really. He's just a crazy spinner. And that's pretty much it. Okay, he's got a hoplite shield. No weapon. Oh, jeez. The teacher's quite crazy. He doesn't need a sword. All he needs is a shield. You give the man a rubber ducky and I'm sure he'll... Or, uh, I mean, a rubber flamingo thing. Chicken, rubber chicken, that's what I want to say. A rubber chicken, and I'm sure he'll defeat his enemies just as intensely as he is right now. Okay, and then the last one is a longsword unit. Whew. Teacher with the longsword? Whoa, that is like an epic longsword. Yo, this is like probably the one of the units that would actually use that correctly. Okay, man. Let me just put up. I want to see how many he can take out at once if you put them if you put enough together can he because that that sword is pretty long i wonder if he can take out how many he can get in one hit ready Doosh. look at that holy smokes he took out all but two oh, yep. all but three that's pretty crazy man oh they got him because he trapped the sword wow that's nuts he took out seven guys at one time that's a pretty cool start to the mod uh, for this guy, Tariosh. He has a YouTube channel, by the way. Okay, main menu, campaign, custom, uh, no, local, no, landfall. That's what, <laughs> the challenge. And we're gonna use some of these units against this. Oh well, yeah, you know, it'd help if I actually click the right thing. Uh, long, we're gonna do a couple long sword guys. We're gonna do a, a spinnerino, but we're gonna, we're gonna, oh, well he actually, I don't know if this will work. If he'll cheer, I'm out of money. I don't know if he'll cheerlead. Uh, potion salad, we need something that can close distance quick. Uh, I don't know, I don't know what else. Hot plate shield maybe. We got, I mean we can do it as many as we want. We have, they cost one dollar. One dollar is. And so, just need something to absorb the damage of the, of the birds. The potion seller unintentionally made himself dodge the crow by falling over. The, this is the only problem with the teacher, man. They don't get up in the battle. They all freak out and like try to do it from distance because they don't want to. They're very cautious about their attack. But obviously, it's going well. <laughs> obviously, things are happening. And things are dying. And it's only a matter of time. There it is. Uh-oh. This potioner is going to get hit over here. Maybe if they get... Dude. What are they doing? Look at them. They, they actually might lose this. We need a teacher with a range thing. So that they can actually get up and attack things. Alright, let's do this. We're going to do one on each side. Small legion. We're going to see if they can take out all these guys. Although... He might be limited in space in here. Oh, is there a snake archer? There's a snake archer though, isn't there? Oh, look at him. Dude, he can take them all out. He's so good. Oh, look at him. Dodging the speed. Oh, he died. But he took out a lot of guys before he went down. Same, well, not so much over here, but you get it. They did okay. I wonder if we... I wonder if we do this right here. Let's put him... Probably need to put them even further. They need time to, well, it's not gonna work. Let's put them back here. Let's see what happens if we do that. Fight. Go in there and fight. The guys. I'm trying to time it so they're in this opening. But I don't know if it's gonna work. Cause I'm thinking that maybe if they're in the opening, they'll do better. Quite amazing though, the teacher. The ability, the skill, the intuition. The training, the expertise. This is quite amazing. They just give a little tap too. They don't even really swing. Ooh, he's taking them all out down there. Look at him go. That's all you need. Three teachers can defeat an entire army. 
Seriously. Seems a little unrealistic. Dude, don't you die, man. You're the last hope. If he would actually go up there, he could actually probably do it. Give the teachers long swords and crazy things happen. Oh, crap. We're gonna have to do this. There we go. Distraction. Now you will die. I think they'll do okay, right? Oh, that one dodged everything. Oh, they jumped again. All right. They did. They do okay, but this one's hard in general. Anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, you know, checking out the teacher with the long sword. He's quite insane, I think so. Anyway, uh, hopefully you're having a great day, guys. See you in the next one.